and dancing just flex. Real flag boss, you know what just flex? Just flex, tell them some prior words. Just flex, keep your posted all prior crews, you know what just flex with. Subscribers, much respect for this old boy. Now, my one, Mr. Ya just flex. Yeah, what I go on, what I go on, my VR subs, bless up, bless up, just bless just a forward income, we give you guys a couple updates also, share a couple videos, but first, bless up all of the people who move here a long time, the ones that are just a forward, and you know, say, well, we don't like the way keep up the time, so continuous bloodshed in St. James, Jonathan Miller, 26 year old of Lapland, Catadupa in St. James, was shot and killed about 10 p.m. Monday night, the neighbor of the now deceased reported hearing loud explosions sounding like gunshots after which he called out to Miller. When Miller did not reply, he went to make checks and found him lying on his back in a pool of blood suffering from what appeared to be gunshot wounds. So the St. James police are now investigating that attack. Yeah, my viewers and subs, so continuous bloodshed in St. James, you know. And we just wish for the best, you know, for the new year coming because 2020 done already and so many things happening, yeah. We just hope say 21 to start out that way. But when I go do my viewers and subs, I just move on to the next update. Yeah, so two teenagers shot in Christian and Manchester, one fatally. Detectives assigned to the Manchester Police Division are probing the circumstances surrounding the shooting death of a teen and the injury of another in Brockwood District, Christiana, Manchester on Wednesday, December 2. Dead is 14-year-old Ricardo Richards, otherwise called Dashan Ashley of DuPont Avenue, Kingston 20. Reports from the Christiana Police are that about 8.20 p.m. Ricardo was sitting on the driver's seat of a undercard motor car while the other teenager was sitting on the bonnet of the car on the roadway when they were pounced upon by gunmen traveling in a motor car who opened fire hitting them several times. The police were alerted and they were taken to hospital where Ricardo was pronounced dead and the other boy was admitted in serious but stable conditions. There you have it, viewers and subs, January two teenagers. Yeah, look a 14 year old gone home. But my viewers and subs, you know, still not keep up. No more time, same way. I just make you guys just watch a couple of videos. I'm soon forward up top. Hello? Yeah, yeah I work, I work, Rasta, but you have to watch it, same way. Yeah, for real. That's you. Yeah, hey, Marcy, you hear me? Marcy, go and go watch your live now, go watch your funny live. Be there here. I don't hear you. What? I'm on the live, I'm on the live. Yo, I'm gonna like to move more time. Just gonna go all over. I want to check No, there's no one. Um, no one was hurt. But they are trying to get it out. But the fire keep on blazing up, bigger and bigger. I'm not saying so. In the other side. I'm not saying so. I'm not saying so. I'm not saying so. I'm not saying so. I'm Jano, when you say gear G, water done? Hmm? Water done? Yeah, man, I jump down this one. Don't take a time for full. I jump them over his side, them then connect it. Yeah, man, I think they can connect. I don't remember if water is another one. I don't think water is another one. Long time I don't think water is another hospital one. 
I think fire agent down there so we are here. Yeah man, they, I think the one down there so we are for his goodness and for his mercy you know this is my first time going live but today I experienced something that I've never experienced before you know um, I was going to Montego Bay but while I was in money there was an accident with a soldier you know the vehicle turned over in money and was pinned to the wall you know I have video that I'm about to send as soon as I done this video and the soldier was just lying there on the ground and the, the other soldier was helping him trying to get him not to close his eye get him to you know respond don't fall asleep or so and while I was the, I, I, I just stopped my vehicle I stopped my vehicle and I run to the soldier and I started to cry, Jesus. I lay my hands on him. And I start to cry, Jesus. And I start to cry, Jesus. And you know, the soldier, the other soldier went on his phone and was calling Monique for help. And I was just shouting, Jesus. Blood was just rushing out of his mouth and out of his nostril. You know, I never see so much blood in my life before. Blood in... He was just coughing up blood, coughing up blood. And I was just saying, Jesus, Jesus. But I realized that while he was coughing up the blood, the blood was going back down. So I had to turn him over upon his side. And when I turned him over upon his side, he tried to get up. I said, soldier, lie down. And he tried to get up again. And I said, soldier, lie down. And I started to plead the blood of Jesus against death. You know, and I, I was there, and, and when I roll him over now, he started to shake. And I said, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. And I command healing in his body. You know, and the other soldier, you know, he touched something that we need to lose. And we lose a strap of, um, over his body that was just chopped on to him. He wanted it to lose, and we lose it. And I was there crying, Jesus. And another lady come and help me cry Jesus. And when we wait and wait for the ambulance, no ambulance not showing up. I heard the soldier said, um, the gun is in, I have the gun, I have this, I have that. But we still didn't see any ambulance. And there and then I still start to cry Jesus. The other soldier asks, who can bring him for him? And everybody come pass by and everybody stop and everybody just looking. And I, I was just looking to see who would have volunteered. And then the soldier asks again, who will carry him? And I have to say, I will bring him, even though I was going to a company. You know, I was going to Mobile to let off some goods from a company. And I didn't want them to blood up, but I still volunteer and say, I will bring him. And I rushed to the van and I, I put the goods them quickly round to the back. And I make a space for him in my van. In the blue and white van that you see in the video. And one time I said, I will bring him. That's when everybody start to help now. But I'm saying to jamaican people i'm speaking to you tonight i'm saying don't look to see somebody blow their last breath and video them till them dead before you offer assistance i've seen many cases i've watched many video where people just look and video to see people blow their last breath when did we as jamaican come to this where we video people till them die when i was much younger when i see somebody get hurt i see people rush them to the hospital no nobody want to help no one but i'm saying even in kaylan's even kaylan's situation 
You know, I blame the five ladies who are beating her so badly. But I also blame them who stand around and watch the person beat her till she almost died. We have a responsibility to help them. We have a responsibility to, to, to put them in our car, put them in our van, put them in our bus. We can't leave their soul. They, they, they can be our mother, they can be our father, they can be our sister and our brother. We have to take the time out. Videoing is important for people to see, but what is most important is a person's life. Life is more important. So I want to say to Jamaican, when did we lost the vision of helping somebody on the way? When did we lost the vision to see somebody dying and assist them? When did, when did our life come to this big joke that we video to see somebody lose their life? So I implore all Jamaican that you share this video. When you see somebody dying, offer help, offer assistance. Somebody is in need. Somebody need your help. And most of all, we thank God. You know, I call, I call a soldier friend of mine. And I heard that his name was Williams. And I'm saying, Williams, you shall not die, but you shall live to the clear I pray that when God bring you out, you will give your life to him. I pray when God bring you out, you will surrender. So Williams, I speak to you. Anytime you get a chance to see this video, I'm saying give God a chance in your life. And I'm saying to us as Jamaican, let us unite as one. We cannot see our brother and our sister by the wayside dying and do all for help. I see people drive by. I see people video people that have been stabbed and saying help. And Jamaican video until that person loses life. So I'm saying to Jamaican, bring back the love in Jamaica. Bring back that unity, that love that when you see your brother and your sister, oh God, you will help them. And before I close, I want to say, Jamaican, those who are not saved, get saved. And those that are in this church playing, they are sold to save. They are sold to rescue. And God has called us for such a time as this. So I'm saying to you, give your life to God. And God will make a way somehow. God bless you tonight. And I share this video with you that you will share it with all Jamaican in Jesus' name. Be blessed in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Finish. You press finish? Yeah, so welcome back my viewers and subs. There you have it. Yeah, so man shot and killed in St. James and also two teenagers shot one fatal. Yeah, in Christiana, Manchester. And the videos now is houses on fire in Lionel Town. And this female here, I'm not telling her. I'm I see that video come across it on Facebook. I'm not I'm listening to her about I said I would have to share it with you guys also and I am not tell you no lie to you no more viewers and subs You might have not seen me upload recently like one time because I am not tell you no lie Come like I want to quit you know <laughs> Yeah, I am not tell you no lie, serious thing, I feel like I would leave out this you know So my viewers and subs, I am keep up no more time, share no comment and we out And them for no side, Jai Meds, representing for Just Blex Just Blex tell them some prior words when the healings are trying for you, was he a dire hurt? The most are alert if I them alone, them alone. Yeah, man, just vex. You don't know your success getting them upset, you know what I mean?